As previously said, ticks are classified as single or one-o ticks, two-o ticks, and three-o ticks. The majority of tick species fall in the category of three-o ticks, and the important species in South Africa are the bond tick or amblyomma species and the brown ear tick. Now, optimal conditions for these ticks to breed are 27 degrees Celsius, plus minus two degrees, and 80 percent relative humidity plus minus five percent. Larvae from these tick species that's on the pastures, well they can survive for several months even up to five months without feeding and they will wait for a host. They will be attracted to the host from the carbon dioxide and body heat coming from the animal and they will climb on the host and start feeding immediately. They feed for approximately seven days and then after that they drop off from the animal and they will molt over several months on the pastures into eight-legged nymphae. The nymphae can survive for a further up to five months on the pastures and they will also wait for the second host. These nymphae will climb onto the host, they will feed again for approximately seven days where after they're engorged and then they will drop off from the second host and molt on the pastures again over several months into adult male and female ticks. The adult female and male ticks can again survive for several months without feeding and when they find a third host, they will climb on, the females will start feeding again for approximately seven days and they will drop off and then lay between five and 18,000 eggs for in the case like the bond tick over several months. And from these eggs, the next generation of larvae will develop. The male ticks will remain on the animal and mate with several female ticks and they will even climb off the animal to find females on another animal to mate with.